Hey there everybody, Fet here, and welcome back to Fet Plays RimWorld Alpha 17. And today we are harvesting, that's all well and fine. Uh, we did, of course, lose, lose Guy, I almost called him Grave. But we also should move him too. I mean, he, he deserves a little bit of respect. We should give him a sarcophagus. We'll make it out of sandstone because it's what we have the most of. But yeah, he, he deserves that respect also because our colonists will actually run out here and, you know, throw their lives away if we don't do this. So let's actually do the smart thing and bury him inside of our colony somewhere. You know what? Let's throw it over here. It'll be our respect area. So... Yeah. Like right here is going to be our first one. We'll, wall, we'll actually wall it in eventually. But for now, we're just, we're just going to leave it out on the in the open. Not on the open. In the open. I'm also thinking we got to expand. This is all great, but we could be greater. Here's what I'm thinking. And feel free to disagree. We remove this floor. We check out all these checkered slabs that look great and beautiful and lovely, but I'm not going to build with them right now. Anyway, we remove this one piece of marble flooring here. And we extend our sandstone wall up to here. And then we have natural defenses going all the way there. And then we could just cut across here to the stone. Boom! All this is now free to use. And it should look pretty good. And allow us to expand our farm area. I mean, we're going up into this mud here. But I don't, I'm not too bothered about that. Not really. I'm a little bit worried about the permanent roofed area here. Because that is a place where insects could appear. I might just actually close that off after we've done all the mining, and then I don't have to worry about it anymore. Okay, then. Also, I'm trying out something different with my recording here. Um, you may notice. You may not, actually. I don't know. But either way, what it's supposed to do is kind of normalize my volume so that when I yell, get really loud and stuff, it's not going to peak anymore and, you know, cause the audio to distort. Right? You don't care about any of that. What, 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 how do I know? You know how I know? You can let me know in the comments if you care. If you even notice, if it sounds good, if it sounds bad, I don't know. Nobody tells me nothing before I uploaded the video, which makes sense. Anyway, Senpai's is getting to work on this right away, which is good. Because then we are going to open up Guy's grave, and we will put him right here, where he belongs. Because you know what? He earned that spot. It doesn't even have anything to do I mean, it, it does have something to do with the fact that I don't want our people going outside to pay their respects and stuff. But also, he earned that spot. He was with us for a very short time. He had only one kidney. He defended us. He hauled so many things. So many things he hauled. He was so good for our colony. How can we not give him the love and respect that I think he deserves? Also, we're going to put a wooden stool here for comfort. Also... I'm going to divide this area. Here's what I'm thinking. Because we, we need places to sit and eat. I mean, look, 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 look at this. Look, look, look at the scorpion. Look at his knees. Look at this. Look at this. Eight without a table. Minus three. Why have this be a minus three when we can make that not a minus three by giving them tables? So I'm thinking. Bear with me. This could be stupid. We divide. Like this. And then we put doors in like this. And then... The freaking area gets its own the wrong way, of course. That's all part of the plan, don't worry about it. Copy settings, paste settings, delete this area. God, that's a lot of blood. Low food, not really, it just looks like it, because, you know, the meat's out here. But, yeah, we're going to divide it like that. And then, over in Furniture Plus, we have full counters. It's kind of like a countertop that connects directly to the wall. And it, I think it will look good. Marble is probably a little more than what we need. But you know what? Let's make it on marble anyway, because it'll look pretty. So I'm thinking... One, two, three, four. And then... One, two, three. Put chairs in front of them. Boom, you have places to eat. Boop, boop, a da boop. And a one, and a two, and a three, and a four. Look at it. It's going to be so good! Once we actually have some marble. Which will... Probably be never, because I have that at the bottom of my uh, chipping list right now. So, let's move that up. 
Ooh, chips. Volpe, do you chip? You're digging at steel. Anyone else chip? Station, do you chip? You're hauling wood. I mean, that's important. You do not chip. Senpai, do you chip? You do not chip. Who else chips? Volpe and Dismas are the only two that chip. Where's Dismas? He's right here. He's making pemmican. That's cool. Get us some marble. We don't need that much of it. So I'm thinking we do this about three, two or three times here. Is this going to give him an actual boost to his crafting? I think it does. No, it does not. Well, that sucks because I'm pretty sure doing it at a bench does actually improve his crafting. So we need to make, not a sculptor's table, a stonecutter's table. We actually need that. We can make it right there because we have the chairs. Let's see, furniture, stools. We can put one here for the prosthetics, one for the table. That's all well and good. Then we can delete this spot. And you know what we should put in place of this spot once this is done? One of these baskets that actually improve... Yeah, crafting baskets. It helps crafting spots, but it's not going to help these two. These two should be helped out by the tool cabinet, though. Or, you know, literally everything can be helped out by the tool cabinet, and I'm an idiot for not building it already. Wow, okay. Uh, yeah. That's that's fine, too. Oh, no, that's, that's cool. I can be... I can be a dinkus. That's, that's fine. <laughs> uh, crap. Okay. Yeah, we'll just build that, like, right here. It's gonna take forever, because we don't have the steel for it, but Volpe's changing that right now. Look at her go. The speed of a million pickaxes. We've achieved 29 steel. That is pretty low. Anyway. Most of the foods got moved. Look at that. We got some marble countertops. Make some more. Don't need that many more. 10 at a time. 10 makes one of them. Yeah, so 20 makes two. We're getting there. Let's see. Yep, we're still missing a couple of marble blocks. Look at it, though. It looks good. It actually looks good. Superior table. Good tape or chair. Excellent chair. Normal chair. Good chair. Good chair. Dude. This room's going to look so good in a minute. There's another one going up. Seven out of eight. Six out of eight. So one more block will do it. There we go. Clear prioritized work. Thank you, Dismas. You've done the job of kings. And now, please haul this meat in where it goes, which is up here. You can only haul that much at a time? What the heck? Okay. And haul this hay. No, nope, someone. Station's got the hay. Station, do me a favor since you're right here. Haul that alpaca high. Okay. Do me a favor. Clean up this blood. I want this to be a decent dining room. I mean, how can that not be my plan? This place would be so good. Hey, 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 hey. Wait a minute. You're not done. Come on. Almost done. Almost there. You're almost there. All right, there's still probably dirt in here, but you know what? It is what it is. It's not done yet, but who cares? 42. It's decent. I'll take it. The uh, marble is only worth five. I would have thought, you know, marble countertops would be a tiny bit prettier than that, but I guess it is what it is. But hey, we have a dining room, and it's decent. We still have a buttload of meat sitting in one spot. I love that so much. Granted, this room is, uh, yeah, not as good. But it is what it is, and we'll live with it. It does what we need it to do. And that's what's important right now. Okay, so what is next? I do want to go ahead and move us up here. Let's actually, just do it this way. All these away, please. Our growing area is fantastic, I think. Once we turn all these berries into pemmican, we will be a very, very happy colony. Not too sure about our defensive area here, but right now I want to kind of keep it just to see how it's going to work out for us. Mm. Let me think here. Yeah, I do want to kind of claim these and move up here. I do like that idea. Hello, free heel root. How you doing? All right. Getting some more steel. That's good. The rest of it's probably going to go into one of these cabinets. Actually, the... Uh, table should be the first priority, since it's a little bit better. We are almost full down here, so we're going to need to have some other crafting areas soon or something. We gotta do something with this. In fact, what we should do... Oh, there you go. That's that's the money right there. That's the ticket. Stonecutter's table. Alright. I think this one is actually much better, because we can make these separate. 
to like a hundred sandstone blocks. Let's do until we have a hundred. Sure, 110. Why not? And then on pause, if we go under, we'll say 40. Yeah, 40. And then we need to make marble. And as you see, when we go to do until we have, it is tabulated separately, which is, you know, 110 of each. Why not? Why 110? Why the heck not? And then, of course, we're going to do some other stone. What do we have up here? Marble, limestone, and sandstone, of course, we have seen. So, marble and limestone and sandstone are, are the three money makers in this colony. Do until we have 110. Pause until we hit 40. 40, there we go. There you go. And then we will just get rid of this stone chipping spot. Because it's not nearly as good as the other one. So eventually we can also replace the crafting spot, maybe? I mean, patching leathers together is... One, it's very fun to say. And two, we should do it. Do forever. Yeah, just put our... Put, put all, words. Put all of our leathers together, my friend. Except for the deer hide. Don't touch that. We have so much of it. We can make stuff out of pure deer hide. But all the others... For the most part, I mean, we do have a, quite a bit of goat hide as well. But for the most part, the rest of them we can patch together. Art spot, I mean, we're, we're not even using it right now. We don't have an artist. It's a good idea, but we don't have anyone to use it, so I'm going to get rid of it. But eventually I want to replace all of these with actual workbenches. You know, to do actual work. We need actually to put in some more mining orders over here. There we go. I would love to be able to have these all replaced with, you know, medieval stuff to replace our Neolithic crap. Because, you know, we're not barbarians over here. We're just people who got lost, okay? Like, Exude is ending. It is what it is. It doesn't bother me too much. I mean, our females, Station of Ulpi, they've been married recently. They're still in their honeymoon phase. They're fine. They're not going to be bothered too much by this. I'm not too worried about any of the other rest of this here. Wooden stools, normal and poor. Ah, That's okay. That's fine. There you go. Our dining room is now done. It's dirty in here, but it's also pretty with all the items that we have, so that's pretty darn good. I'm, I'm happy with that. Our prison, of course, is a little mass of hell on Earth. I could put tables in here. You know what? You can put tiny tables down now. You know what? Let's do that. You want a place to eat? You can have places to eat. You dang food. There you go. And then places to sit. You get stools. There we go. There's your prison. Your prison area. You can also put shelves here. Like it says, we can put things on it. We line this with shelving. I don't know why I would want to do that yet. I'm thinking about it. The uh, hell? Highway lamppost. Okay. I assume it needs electricity, but it's cool. And of course, all these lamps, all these new lamps, which are nifty, end table with lamp on it. This is cool. I like this. I like this idea a lot. I want to build them, but I assume you need the electricity to actually use the lamp. Otherwise, it would be kind of nonsensical. But yeah, we have places to eat and stuff now. This is all well and good. We have plenty of food. We're making pemmican. We are making smoked meat. We have one herbal medicine, which they last quite a while by themselves, so no harm, no foul there. Crafting spot, patch leathers together. Oh, yeah. I almost forgot. I was like, what are we doing here? Why do we have someone working on this? Because they're patching leathers together. Ten emu leathers make what? Show me. Patched leather. Well, I guess that just makes sense. You're going to have 50 after putting these two emu leathers together, or how it works? Is it one-to-one -one ratio? No, we have a bunch of them. Holy cow. Low-quality leather patched together from scraps. Okay. So it's not as good as regular leather. That's good to know. Not very good insulation. Alright. That's good stuff to know, but it will allow us to at least use these for other things and then use our deer hide for, like, bigger projects. I mean, the barracks is still awful, but that's mostly because of the blood the vomit, which just tend to be not good. 
Frost apparently thinks this is the right time to meditate. I'm not one to hold it against him. Why would I? I mean, what do I care? Making more steel. Makes me happy. We need to get this tool cabinet done eventually, so we need more mining to get done on that front. We have 92 sandstone right now. How much does it cost for a piece of wall? I do not remember. Someone please remind me. I think it's five each. Yeah, five each. So, yeah, we can whoop up here. We're gonna not leave an opening there, because I don't want to risk that, but how much do you need to do this? Oh, okay. Well, you can't build on mud. What? Ugh. That hurts our plan a little bit. It doesn't have to, though. You can just, like, go under the mud, right? Yeah, the mud is here. The mud is not here, so we just uh, go like this. Nope, because there's mud here. Oh, the mud, man. The mud, it hurts. No matter what, we have to deal with the mud. All right. Yeah, because if we're here, we, it gets blocked here. And if we go one lower, it gets blocked there. Uh, can we go under the mud, then? I guess? Like, right here to here? It's not nearly... A, well, it's actually quite a bit of extra space, still. I mean, 270. I mean, it's gonna get done eventually, right? It is the top bill. I don't have any sandstone set to haul in. Let's uh, haul all of this in when we have the chance so that our crafters can craft. Mm, I think I think for Dismas, your crafting can be higher than your cooking for now because we have two other people who cook at a relatively high capacity. Oh, someone open this. Why does guy not moved yet? Okay. Patience on it. She's going to get a mood debuff here, but she's like already at 100%. So, boop. And then she's going to go... Just don't bury him in here, you dinkle! No. No, 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 no. To... Clear all. Stop it. Stop it. Oh, my God. Why? A sign. No. Put him down. You put guy... You put guy down. Why can't I put him in here? There we go. Assign him to this one. Now put him in the correct one. Thank you. Okay. There we go. Jeez, the things you have to do just to get someone buried in the right place. Good quality sarcophagus. Station has created distant vaulty. Trail of the minor celebrity Kenta moving to the left. Who the hell is Kenta? Ordered by five sardines. Totally devoid of both goodwill and war. Thanks? I guess? I guess that's one way to honor his memory? Maybe? I don't know. Alright, so what we need to do, to do now is actually create a door over here. So, I'm thinking we're going to chop down these... And just kind of put a wooden door here for the meantime. Senpai, what are you doing? Making pemmican. How about you, E? Deconstruct this wall. Thank you very much, good sir. I'm going to do that for now. He has plenty to build. He'll be happy for a while. He's like, oh yeah, I got jobs to do! <laughs> Alright. There we go. And that'll let us turn this place into, um... Oh, well, more colony. Which is good. We need more space anyway. I mean, there's stuff... We, we can use stuff down here, but... Really, up here is where it's at. I could probably turn this into a defensive perimeter now that I think about it. I'm gonna build one more spot of marble wall right there. Just to, just to balance that out. And then we'll end up putting a door down here, but we'll just open it for now. Thank you, Sation. Sation, you're so good. You're so good with the hauling and the cleaning and the stuff doing... Alright. Am I getting better at research? Do I still suck at it? Oh, I'm getting a lot better. I'm at 16 out of 20 already. Okay, never mind. I'm not going to complain about myself anymore. Good job, Senpai. You done it. Also, we need to claim all this as our own, because we probably haven't done that yet. Oh, we have. Why is this? Oh, because probably it's not part of the home area. Yeah, this is now... This is all soon to be... 
part of our home. Probably not this stuff in here, but probably, yes, this stuff in here, because why not? And then all of this is home as well. There we go. Okay. Go ahead and set this to be mined out, too, because I can. There you go. Is our workshop done? Or workshop, our, uh, yes, tool cabinet is done. Is connected to all of these, which means that our stone cutting should be more efficient now. Which is perfect, and might I add, maybe even a touch professional. I know I only have the wooden doors up here, but I'm hoping that by the time this is all done, I won't need to put in the steel, or I can just move steel doors up here. Hmm. I don't think I need to reinforce any of this anymore, actually, with the wooden doors. Yeah, I should probably take those down now, right? Hmm. I wonder if I should or not. Item stash opportunity. 24 hours. Wow, that is a big... 300 smoke leaves. Oh, wow. This is a huge lap. Huge one. Let's see. Others will take the items in 28 days if we don't. Wow. Okay. Thank you, Southeast Hados Concord. They have no idea who or what might be guarding the stash. Oh. We need to trade them 400 silver. We don't have any trade beacons. So we can't do this. Great. Thanks. No, I love you guys too. Yeah, you're beautiful and great people. We can't build a trade beacon, you jokers. You see trade beacon down here? Because I don't. Man, we don't have the smarts to do that. What kind of superhuman constructs do you think we are? All right. Dismas has apparently decided he's going to make leathers all day instead of making, uh... Yeah, hey, 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 Dismas, I love you, man. I love you. But let's do until we have, like, uh, you know, 250, and then pause it until we're at, like, 50. Until then, why don't you leave this alone? <laughs> yeah, you've made us plenty of leathers. Make us some freaking rocks, dude. Now, I just want to check and make sure I'm correct on this. Uh, crafting skill. 31, 32 goes up. No, it doesn't. I thought stone cutting helped with that, but I'm wrong. Eh, it's not that big a deal. It's it's really not. Something I had hoped, but hopes are often dashed here on RimWorld. We all know this. But that said, our stone is going up quickly. Yeah, we are building this very nice, very effectively. I like it. I don't think we need the double walls. The more that I think about it, the less I think it's necessary. So, I'm gonna go ahead and get our wood back from these. And it will give us more space with which to do other very nice and lovely things. So, like expand our crops, for example. Oh, wait. Uh, some of this needs to be, needs to stay out. Let's just keep that up for now. There you go. Until this is done, which is, at this rate, it's gonna be done quickly. Go ahead and haul this stuff into what is all this uh limestone good good we need limestone in theory that theory is probably wrong but i like limestone it does make some pretty materials Let's see mm, i, I want to first i want to eat this rat second muscle parasites is bad scorpion has them they don't kill him they're not deadly i don't think i don't think they were deadly Maybe they are? I don't remember now. Oh, boy. Either way, it needs tending. Dude, go rest. There you go. Minor break risk, probably on him. Yep. No, no that's these three. Yeah, on him. All right, Station. It's time for you to do your stuff. Yeah, dead rat. I get it. It's important. Dude, with the resting... There you go. Yeah, it just hurts. It makes him very tired. Very quickly. It sucks, needless to say, but... Not the worst thing that's ever happened to us. Alright. Structure, door, steel. Line it up with this, because why not? There we go. And there will be our new entrance... To... The north side here. Which is close to the road, which is good. Can we actually, like, build a flooring going straight? Tor the tortoise is self-named. Okay, cool. 
we like build like a packed dirt road going up to there? No, because of the mud! You know what? In that case, let's not build the doors here. Let's build it somewhere where we can build a road to. Pack dirt from the road down the here like that. And we could also like make pack dirt road like this. I don't know. Actually, this, this can go like straight out to the road now that I think of it. Pack dirt straight out to the road like that. And the bottom entrance doesn't really need any pack dirt. Screw it. <laughs> but yeah, it, it, it looked good. And sometimes that's all I care about is looking good. There you go. Next day, starting up right now. It's going to be good. It's going to be a great day. Scorpion's already awake. He's like, oh my god, I have worms in my muscles and it hurts so mad. But he can't really do anything about it, so he's going to have to live with it and relax socially. With no one around him, relax with. Anyway, Senpai, what's your plan here? Eating pemmican. I mean, that's kind of everyone's plan. But look at this. Needs. <gasps> okay, they don't care about the dining room. <laughs> well, at least they didn't get a negative thought. I had hopes. I had high hopes. They were dashed. They were dashed so hard. Oh, well. I don't know why we built a roof over that, but I guess that's okay. Wait, 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 wait. Harvest that. Can you harvest it? No? Well, then stop cutting it, you doofus. What did I just say? Oh, you know what? Get it. Cut it. Because we're going to have to cut it down either way. There's no point in saving it. We'll take this wild devil strand, though. Why not? Dude, you cut trees down so slowly. There you go. But look at the rate that he makes this packed dirt road, dude. It is faster than the regular soil. Harvest everything. Oh my god, that's a poor harvest. Please tell me we have corn already harvested. We do not. It's 61%. Oh, I hate you so much right now, Cassandra Classic. I hate you so much. But at least we're getting some herbal medicine. No, no, no. Harvest, harvest, harvest. This is not harvesting. There you go. Get it all right now. Yeah, the, that road looks good. That's a sexy road. I mean, it looks like someone lives in this, you know, relative area. Negative one. <laughs> You're kidding me. Why? Every time, every game, every season, there's a cold snap in the middle of spring. And there's nothing I can do about it. Ugh. Oh my god. Dude, look at Senpai go. Also, Senpai. Senpai, Senpai, Senpai. With the freaking roof, man. All of this is going to be no roof area, okay? We're going to keep it that way. Thank you. At least we're getting some wood out of it. Uh, yeah, that, all of those are going to die. They're both. Senpai's gotten food poisoning. But we have 16 herbal medicine. I mean, I, I, I can't deny that that's very good. But losing this corn when it was on the precipice of growing, of being harvestable? That's a kick in the butt. Ugh. Damn you, Rimworld. Damn you all the heck. God, that's so bad. Oh, do we still have an order out there to forage? We do. That's good. What is this 398? It's not all hay. What is this 398 target count freaking stuff that you're... Last storm, I don't care. Vegetarian? Berries, corn, potatoes, and rice. We don't have any of that. We have some hay. Are, are you counting the... Me count the herbal... You don't count textiles! Textiles are not food! 
This is a food only pile. 185. Yeah, that's more like it. Get us some more freaking plants, dude. I don't know where this was. It's out here. Okay, it's not a big deal. Okay, this area is all covered. You know what that means? It means we deconstruct all this, too. Yes, we do. And then that right there. And voila! Our place grows. I mean, these are not going to grow now, are they? Yeah. Yeah, it's negative nine during the middle of the day! So we're boned again! Thanks to the freaking winter! I like the packed roads. I like that. Very nice. Oh. Alright. Bad animal. A local rat needs to go F itself. What's wrong? You can't get in? I know you can. What are you doing? What are you doing, rat? Senpai will mess your stuff up. Senpai done fool around, dude! I wouldn't do it! I wouldn't do it! I told you I wouldn't do it! One shot, one kill is all you need. <laughs> Alright, we're putting on cloaks. I mean, it's a start. I mean, you put on a better quality one, but still, it's, it's good. Okay, well, you know, because that wasn't enough, now I got manhunt... Are you joking me? Uh, Pulpy does have a gun, yes. All right, let's go. Scorpion does not have a gun. Can he have a gun? I mean, technically, yes, he can, but... Uh, that's really crappy. Okay, put it on this gun. Put it on like a piece of freaking clothing. Where, where, where are you? Oh, my God. All of you line up out here. And don't shoot, Scorpion! Uh. Dude, pull out your... Why don't they pull out their freaking other weapons? I don't understand how this works. You can still shoot. You have to switch. You have to switch. Why haven't you switched? Oh, the shotgun is working out so well here. Uh, release the hound. Serenade. There you go. Okay. They're biting. They're biting, guys. And it hurts. Okay. We're done. Everyone picked up their weapons already, which is actually amazing. If we can harvest all of these bulls and cows, we will be in great shape. Although I'm tempted... Did any of the... Nope. All the cows died. Only the bulls survived. Because, once again, game can't let me have anything nice or come close to it. But whatever. Let's go. Let's go. God, that's actually the end of this episode. We're ending on that sour-ass note of all of our plants dying. Rimworld, why do you hate me this much? Oh, these... these none of these are alive. Um, we need to rescue one of these. This one. This one's younger. Maybe we can save one. Rescue this cow. We're going to try to tame it. And then we'll eat this one. Pulpy <sighs> is getting patched up. Not a big deal. Dismas is already patched up. Thankfully, Satian is an amazing doctor. And even with low medicine, she can do wonderful things. But that is going to be it for this episode of That Plays Rimworld Alpha 17, guys. If you are enjoying the series... Please let me know, because otherwise it's just gonna keep making me cry like this. I don't know how my I don't know how your enjoyment of that is gonna make Cassandra Cla Classic. I can't talk right now. Cassandra Classic treat me any better, but I'm hoping it will. Thanks again, everybody, for watching this episode of Fent Plays Rimworld Alpha 17, and I will see you in the next video.